How the hell have you managed to put up with those terrible four for so long? Well, that's quite an interesting <laughs> question, yeah. <laughs> See a stone set in your eyes. See the fall twist in your side. It's very unusual for five guys to work together for 27 years which is how long it's long been, time. long time. Well, and I think we're as good at staying out of each other's way as we are at being together. That's right. probably it. Because you have been described as the fifth member of you two. I would put it a different way, fifth member of the board. Okay. Um, there are only four people in the band. Okay. What would you say is the key to their success? Talent. Mm -hmm. Ambition, um, stamina. The records seem to take a very long time to make. They don't make. They, it, it's not getting easier to make the records, and I think that's that's probably the key to why they're still relevant. They really, really put the effort in. Charge production manager. Yep. For your sins, <laughs> for you two. <laughs> for my sins. Can we have a little look around? You know, it's the best. This is your house, yeah. apparently. Our amazing video wall designed by Willie Williams, which is, you can see how many pixel lights in it, which is like a hundred foot wide video screen. Yeah, it's brilliant. Have you ever had anything go really wrong? Yeah, but we wouldn't tell you that, would we? Oh, Have come on, no. I need to know. What really wrong? I fell off the stage once, no. No. No, I mean, I mean more, more... Like what? Has anything really badly gone wrong? I mean, you know, the worst thing that can go wrong is the sound system goes out, because you can play a show without lights, you can play a show without video, but you can't play a show without you two and sound, can you? Uh -huh. in charge of sound. Yeah, that's my role, that's my responsibility, and I cherish it. How long have you been with this band for? Uh, since they were little garsoons, <laughs> as they say in Ireland. Uh, 27 years this year, in September. Are you mad? I'm guessing after 27 years, you've got kind of a shorthand between you all. Yeah, well, you know, there are things that, uh, that you, you know, you obviously get to know uh, in the context of when Bono does certain movements and certain, you know, uh, vocal parts and things like that. I know exactly, I get a feel for what's going on and uh, it's a second nature thing, you know. Okay, talk me through. Uh, this is where we control all the lighting and video, mm -hmm. and it's a very modern system. Um, <laughs> no, it's very clever, and all of the video clips are stored in various computers. This uh, is basically a way of moving through the clips. I can play them here, and I can go from place to place. This is a fantastic Belgian uh, beverage, and look at this for a product name, Loser. Surely that, surely that shouldn't be around all this time. I drink Loser. I, re I, recommend, I recommend Loser orange juice. <laughs> It's 
sounds to me like it's like E.T. or is it no Close Encounters it's one of those beautiful melodies that gives you faith in the future and we've got plenty of faith in the future so live eight mm. are you looking forward to it we don't know much about I don't know much about it I mean I'm looking forward to as far as I'm concerned, Sir Bob says, can you be part of this? We are absolutely there in whatever way we can. Mm. So there's a lot of unanswered questions like, what are we going to do? What, what's, what's the thing going to be like? But I, I don't care. I, it's one of those events that's just, it's going to be great no matter what. We're happy to be part of it. Want a tree inside your head. Spend the day there. Hear the thing. You haven't said, see what you might see. I wanna hear you when you call. Do you feel anything at all? I wanna see your thoughts take shape and walk right out. Freedom as a sense, like the time. What does Live Aid mean to you guys? A chance to do the song that we couldn't do the last time, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Live Aid was the making of the band as an international act, but things didn't run as smoothly as they should due to Bono's ever-growing need to connect with his audience. We're supposed to play three songs. In the second one, which is called Bad, from the Unforgettable Fire, we got distracted or I got distracted, jumped off the stage. And I saw someone in the crush underneath and sort of created this moment where I held on to them, she held on to us and the world held on to each other. It was just one of those moments. Pissed off, you didn't get to the hit. Fair enough, maybe we'll play it this time. <laughs> well, we didn't know what you were doing. You jumped down and you, you could have been off having a cup of tea. It started again. I think <laughs> I've opened a whole can of worms. <laughs> but are you excited well, if about it? He told us, he's like written to us. Uh, Let it go. It happened a long time ago. Yeah. Let it go. Just release. It's a worm. It's You'll a be working bite. yourselves into all kinds of knots. Yeah. Larry's poor arms now. They were so tired for having yeah. to play that beat. That's why. So that's why. Just, yeah. Yeah. Put the drumsticks down. Well, okay, yeah, what I'm doing this time is I'm taking precautions this time. I'm bringing a little tape recorder. <laughs> and what will happen is if he disappears, <laughs> if he disappears, I'm just going to press go. <laughs> the purpose of this year's concert, Live 8, is to affect real change. An Irish newspaper once joked that Bono only goes on tour with you 2 to holiday from his real job as a political campaigner. It's going to be very difficult to get real change out of Glen Eagles and this G8 meeting. I know enough about these G8 meetings and I've been to enough of them to know that it's the last few minutes, it's the deals they cut. They're sitting in that room saying, how are we going to go out and face the public unless we agree on this, this and this? And the French will say, oh, but we want to do this. And the Germans will say, yes, but we want to do this. And the, the, the Americans go, you got to do what we want to say. And then the British will say, no, no, no. They won't agree and they'll say, we'll put it off. And the only thing that will stop them walking out the door and saying, we're putting this off till next year, or we're putting this off till September, is a deafening roar of people saying, get back in there till you've got an agreement. It's the only thing that'll do. But I'm waiting on the crumbs from your table. Live Aid in the 80s was about charity. Live Aid uh, in the zeros is a 